I think a lot of people confuse the word uh, uh, AI with uh, true human intelligence and uh, things like planning, judgment, compassion, self-awareness. None of those things work today. AI today is a pattern recognizer. It uses a large amount of data in a single domain and reaches judgment in ways that are more accurate than humans. So the single domain might be recognizing faces, recognizing speech, deciding if to give someone a loan, uh, or to what uh, ad to promote within the commercial website, or of course playing Go as we all know. I think most of the investments are going into actual applications of AI because we've reached a point where deep learning as a core technology is ready for prime time, ready for applications. So it can be applied from uh, financial applications, investment, loans, banking, all the way up to uh, face recognition, security, and uh, autonomous vehicles and robots. In terms of short-term impact, I'm most uh, excited about financial applications because financial applications are narrow applications using quantitative data to make a determination and the result is directly saving or making money. Uh, in terms of long-term uh, big impact, autonomous vehicles in the way in which it changes our transportation and logistics is phenomenal. Uh, but really my favorite and the one I'm really longing to do is cure for cancer. Um, I am myself am a, a cancer survivor. Uh, I know what people go through, the helplessness, and I see that the type of uh, uh, phenomics as well as the image recognition uh, are all within grasp of deep learning. We're kind of stuck at this point, not getting enough data due to privacy issues, and I'd love for the world to work together uh, to share the data, but anonymize it so we don't uh, invade anyone's privacy, but the whole world should share the data because one could argue about ethics in terms of autonomous vehicles or lungs. We, when it comes to fighting cancer, we should all stand together as human beings. Singularity is far enough off, we can let the people who study it study it and not, lever not let everyone worry about it because what can we do? Uh, let this, uh, the, the deep researchers worry about it. But I would worry about two things. One is AI taking away jobs and how are we going to create jobs that people can do and AI cannot do so that the jobs can be sustainable. The other big worry is the widening gap of the haves and have nots because with all this money and wealth going to the people who create and use AI, and then people's jobs are starting to be taken away, um, maybe in five, 10, maybe in 20, 30 years, but it's going to be a lot of them. And then, and even for those who keep their jobs, I think the wage will be going down. So that widening gap and then inequality it creates, what are we uh, as human beings going to do about that?